not a great matchup for Min Min. Yeah. But uh, I think I have a lot of fun with it. I think it's doable, um, and I'm excited to actually like be able to know what I'm talking about. Yeah. So this is super exciting for me specifically. Nice. No, that's super exciting. <laughs> and it's also exciting that both of these players do not seem to have entered a Brawls yet unless they have gone by different names in the past. Mm. But we do see their global stats. Yeah. Uh, both Retrobot, quite impressive. Really, uh, I don't, I've never heard of Retrobot. Yeah. I overheard uh, that they were out of town coming from Virginia. Oh, MDVA. That's right. Robs. Little Invader coming through. So we'll see how this goes. All but right. So what Magnus has got to do, um, obviously, like, Rob has, like, a gazillion tools to um, try to keep Min Min away. Min Min can mitigate that. The neutral is, like, relatively, like, okay for, for Min Min. It's, it's when she gets off stage that it's a real, like, right. it's a real problem. So if Magnus, you know, if Magnus wants to win, uh, definitely has got to be creative with recoveries and, um, you know, uh, make sure and try to limit off stage time as much as possible. Right. If this matchup ends up not working out, do you know if Magnus has any uh, pockets? No, I do not. Okay. Uh, he, I, I, we were playing friendlies before Racket started, and I was like, "Yo, who's this?" Because uh, I was like, "Another Minmin, my guy." Right. Um, and I was like, "Oh, you got anyone else?" And you said, "No." Nope. All right. Tried and true. You love all to Min -Min see all it. All Min all the time. Yeah, I would say this like, uh, I don't know. I Retrobots certainly got stats that are intimidating, so we'll see if Magnus is yeah. uh, up to the task. Right. No, as far as matchup checks go, I mean there are. Rob's a plenty about in this game, uh, not only just in this region, but I feel like around the world. So it's got to be something you, you have to expect. That you will face a Rob at some point. Exactly. You but have to know how to play it. What it is that separates the upper echelon of Rob's from the other ones that you'll end up seeing. And I'm excited to see the way that Retrobot is able to express mm. their Rob's to make them stand out and what is responsible for this incredible record that they have. But they seem to be getting into it really quickly. Let's see how this yeah, goes. I would imagine first stage is probably PS2. Yeah. If I'm... If because uh, they will both want a lot of space. I must give credit yes, to both it. of these skins as well. These are my favorite skins for both of these characters. <laughs> All right. All right. So uh, one thing, yeah, you can see, like, sort of immediately um, Magnus wants to just, like, try to keep, like, Rob as far away as possible. Right. Um, because as soon as Rob gets in, like, the, uh, he, it, or whatever, can outframe Data Min Min so hard. Yeah. Good job getting out of that um, uh, gyro setup. Yeah, no, I, as far as playing from that mid-distance, they're doing quite well as far as the pressure goes. I mean, just making sure that they're right within uh, a bit too close for Min Min's comfort. And yeah. as you can yeah. see, bit Retrobot, there. Yeah, Retrobot is really, like, trying to get, okay, all right, really, we're starting to get a solid edge guard. You have to be ready for that. Yeah. Um, but, the, you know, the good use of arms to sort of try to keep Rob in disadvantage. Yeah. I would love to see a little more jumping, um, but Whoa. why do you need to jump when you can just whack him with a powered-up dragon arm? <laughs> Full send. Powerful. The up smash is not going to do it at this percentage. Min Min is decently heavy, but that, that will, will certainly do it. And we are taunted get bodied on uh, Magnus <laughs> Carlton's part. And so we'll see approaching with some nares as always, and also like trying to utilize every single item at their disposal, but really taking a back seat for a second as soon mm. as they're realizing it's not quite working. Yeah, I would I would be wary. Um, I've seen a, I've seen Magnus do this a couple times. Uh, we'll get a little grounded dash, uh, grounded smash attack happy, yeah. um, and that you know for especially an aerial character like Rob, you're probably not going to be. Uh, landing a lot of those and it's really and it's so laggy that you know you're really allowing Rob to get in but right now doing a great job of just sort of standing in place yeah. and making sure to punch Rob away that's really good switching to megawatt maybe uh, looking for put Rob in like serious disadvantage uh, pretty early um, oh. oh oh great oh. tech and getting the up smash for it it's quite a fast up smash right it is as a fast, very fast as fast boxes yeah, if I'm not mistaken I believe it's frame nine oh. it's, it's very uh, it's very good as an out of shield option right. it's not like it's not a it's not game of watch it's not Samus up B but, but it is good, very good. You know, as we saw right there, no, really got them out of dodge after trying to go yeah. for an insane roll read. Didn't quite find it, but still the pressure Ooh, is being put that's on. A great, that's a great parry. Oh, oh. and I really like that yeah. um, rising with the second arm to, um, you know, sort of catch Retrobot off guard. Mm -hmm. Oh, tried to get the laser up, but not quite. Ooh, and what that, happened there? That, um, you know. I have I, no I idea. Tell, I, I couldn't tell, tell you. I think... Uh, just hold him. Hold. Oh no! And oh that is no! You do, you do not. You it. do not ever challenge the the spinnies. You don't challenge the spinnies. Oh my it's, lord! I don't. It would. It, oh, at zero two, it wouldn't have gotten anything. Um, that could be a costly error. But I mean, uh, Magnus has been playing this neutral 
like immaculately yeah. uh, so far. But and as we've seen, like both kills have just been like you got you got in, put into the circle. Right, Magnus fighting tooth and nail to assert their stage presence. Yeah, and it is working so far. Yeah, I you know um, it looks like the sort of okay Retrobots starting to get their game plan going, which oh. is get in Min Min's face and out frame data. Her. Right, yeah, and it's working so far, but all it takes is one thing to reset okay. the positioning, and right there we see it again. Megawatt to shoot Retrobot uh, way to the other side of the yeah. stage, but now Retrobot has center. We're setting up a ledge trap, but ooh, that back air could have been deadly, but uh, good awareness by Magnus to get out of that. Ooh, uh, see, that's, that's what I'm talking about, that grounded smash attack. Oh, oh no! and they oh, get no! it. They were looking they were for looking it before. For it all came and finally, finally said, fuck it, I'm sending it again. That was a oh. wonderful call out. Oh, really man. well played by Magnus and honestly probably should have won that game. Got a little yeah. little kill happy right at the end. Like that a was little tragic. That was a little bit of Let's like I'm again. gonna I wanna kill now. Like these are like these are smash attacks to kill now and oh. then a panic a panic roll in. Well it was um, good because they set up the gyro to decentivize them from rolling that way. And so yeah. where else do you come? Oh hey Jiffy, honestly. yeah, yeah, yeah. That's me. That's me on comms. What's up? I'm very excited because this is Min Min, baby. This is my character. <laughs> We're going right back to PS2 for game two. Uh, not even a question. Um, one thing that I do like is uh, uh, Magnus is doing a pretty good job at like snuffing out the gyro when it's thrown with uh, yeah. just like an arm to have a clank and make it go away. Oh, and there, in, instead of opting to go for more down tilt and really let uh, continue on that frame data pressure, they adopt to go for their gyro instead. You know, I, I don't, out, I don't mind that because so many people will panic in that situation. Right. Like, uh, to, like I'm getting down tilted. I, I need to, like, run away as far as possible. Yeah. And, yeah. See, nice. This, all right. Okay. Good little scoop to get out of that offstage situation. Will be able, they be able to get out of the next one? Yes. Oh, tried to go for the reflector as tried well. Tried to go for the reflector <laughs> on the charge shot a little early because yeah. that charge shot was coming. It's the Rob classic. Oh, I've thrown the gyro. Now I throw my yep. late, now I throw my laser. But now both 93%, but 96, but still neck and yeah, neck very right now. Even. I'm nice. very su surprisingly yeah. even considering oh. how. Oh, great, great air dodge and going low. Yeah. Yeah, that was awesome. That mega one almost hit. Getting right? that. Or it did hit. Uh, oh, this is going to be up smash. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah although fantastic there was, although mash, there was a mash, but, but yeah. Too high percent. Right. All right. Starting to do the Rob neutral things. Uh, and the parries, oh, the, on parries point. Are, the parries are super on point. Parries are like a, a death sentence for mid minute. Like, um, because if you can parry the second one and you're close enough, that is a, mm -hmm. a big opportunity to punish. Oh, yeah. That's nice. a, that is a checkmate These situation. Reads. I mean, that that one was definitely because Slow. the gyro was on the other right. side. Like, you you're only you only got one place to go. Okay, no, great grab. That like, was a fantastic grab. Oh, and it terrible DI. I, yeah, it does kill, but like that. that was that was just bad DI. That was an ill-advised uh, runoff stage. Although they may actually get the favorable, they get the favorable stage positioning yeah. out of it, and now they've got the ledge trap of their own. That's and actually it's working out. All right, Rob going super high. The ledge trap continues. Stacking up the percentage, 76, yeah, 76. already. Now this is an even game. Oh, you got to be ready for that laser in that position. Oh, oh okay, okay. Right the back. laser, the laser is, is uh, what sort of what's yeah. that hitbox there? And just keep like all of this damage on Retrobot right now, and Retrobot's Running out of gas. Out of gas. That all of that damage, that pressure. entire stock was just one ledge trap yeah. sequence for Magnus Carlton. That was beautiful. Okay, going for the down tilt up smash. Uh, Retrobot's wisely not dropping shield. Yeah. A rapid jab, get off me. Down smash, okay. Oh, see what it, was the, it was the right idea. This is the tech, but oh, going not for this time. One. Not, not this time. time. I'm sure that uh, that move has secured uh, Retrobot many mm -hmm. a stock because uh, that's about like the fifth time I've seen them go for it in this set. Great pause on the mash and is able to survive oh, the up air. Oh my lord! Able to get through the down smash. Not going to do Still it yet because it was on the other side. The stock. All right, this is a tough position. Yeah. Yeah. There's, yeah, I mean, like. <laughs> Rob F. Till kills like the funniest yeah, thing I, to me. I like the, like the get-up attack option because yeah. there's really nothing you're, you're going to do. Okay. So, uh, you know, it looks like it should be Magnus's game uh, to win at this point, but th Rob is definitely a character who will, who can just, like, do Min Min in one combo. Right. Um, right now, you know, playing mostly safe, although the, percent the percentages are evening up. Tries to end it right there with that back air, oh, but no! the rotor arm should no, no, do no, no. it. Yeah. yeah. Oh. Two that heartbreakers for Magnus because right. I really feel like played that extremely well and just got a little impatient at the end. Yeah. Uh, got a little a little nervous with their options, throwing out like "please die" smash attacks, yeah. and uh, and Retrobot was able to take advantage. Yeah, that was nice.